Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is Wayne DeGroot from DCube, ddd.ca. Today's lesson is advanced, and we're going to be talking about uh, grade lines, how to create a grade line, which is very similar to a typical. Okay. Uh, what I'm going to do, uh, let's just take a look at, uh, we have uh, already made the uh, grade already. If you're not really familiar with how to make a grade properly inside a soft plan, click on over here, baboof, and that will show you how to get where we are right now. All right, inside of the foundation, which is where I put my grade, and I'm going to slip down to site plan. Okay, so what I have here is I have a grade height of 7.5 in the uh, top here, 7.5 and left and right. 7.5 is all along here. And then it's going to go down to 4 feet at the back of the house. And then at the bottom of the property, I have 2 feet. What I want to do is put a little piece of flat land uh, here so I can put in my pool. All right. So I'm going to take on uh, a little piece of flat area, so I'm just going to click on here. So what it's doing, and I probably should zoom in here, when I click on a certain spot, it'll probably kick up a, an elevation. The reason why it's changing to 4 feet, because I want it to be 4 feet, the reason why it was 3.8, or in this case 3.7, is solely because the um, the shot point that I pick is because it's being molded already with um, the the, the uh, present shot point. So I'm gonna um, keep on going around the corner here and go like so. Okay, so again I have my two in the corners and I have four is this entire area here because I want to put a little pool right here. Okay once I have the plans done then I going to do a save and then slip over to draw and grade generate grade lines as a default the increment is set to every five feet mm. let's um let's do every six inches the reason why is because um, I, I want to really show a lot of lines just so people see the grade. You wouldn't normally do every six inches unless of course it's very minute changes. Alright, so here we go. And there we go. So I'll zoom in here, but uh, on the very top again as a reminder it's, it's 7.5 feet up. I'm going to zoom in here and there is 7.5, then it goes down to 7 feet, 6.5, etc, etc. So it depends on how exact you are. Now I just chose a whole bunch of spots, so it actually connected all of the 7.5s that I put in and all the 4 points, uh, sorry, the 4 foots that I put in and all the new 4 points and then it's going to be drifting from the 4 down to 2 at the very bottom here. So that is it. That's how to do it. So if you um, have any request on how to do anything inside a soft plan, please email me at softplantv at ddd.ca. Thank you so much for watching Soft Plan TV.